Hey guys, it's Andriana, and my name is Candice, and we're here to tell you about day four. Day four is all bananas and skim milk and water. So you're supposed to have eight to ten bananas. At this point, I think we had about six of these. And then we're supposed to have three glasses of skim milk and eight to ten glasses of water. Boom. Hopefully you watched the previous video and I would totally slap myself talking about, oh, I don't think skim milk will be that bad. Uh, you're looking at two people that have never had skim milk before today, so maybe if we didn't know it was supposed to be milk, maybe if it just had a weird different name, chalk. Yeah, we would take it as, oh, that's what that tastes like, but ugh, oh my gosh, it, mm -mm. We did find a way that we could get it down. Um, we took frozen bananas and the skim milk and we put it in the blender with some ice. And, and it wasn't that bad, but we had to figure out the ratio. Uh, like say we put a cup of skim milk in there, but that's useless because then we'd only each be having a half a cup of skim milk. So I definitely got like my first cup out of the way this morning. I had to plug my nose. I don't, I don't know what it tastes like. It's just, it has an aftertaste. I, I feel like milk should taste almost like water. Nope. <laughs> just cleanier. I want to slap myself for saying, uh, oh, three, but it, it will. Skim milk sucks. Don't let anybody fool you that that stuff tastes good. It doesn't even have a milk flavor. It was horrible. Yeah. Like. Oh my goodness, it tastes so bad. And then after, since it only we only use about like a cup and a half, um, I poured more into mine, and I ruined the whole thing. But I drank it, so I got like a cup and a half left to go. If skim milk was a person, skim milk would probably be my biggest hater. <laughs> <laughs> like, you don't fuck with skim milk. The bananas, it's not that bad, but like when I'm hungry, I just like, like yesterday was like, oh, fruits and veggies, and I could just, you know, do a cucumber salad or something. It's like, if I'm hungry today, guess what I'm eating? A banana. And we've tried, we, we uh, put them on a griddle, no oils or anything, and like obviously they're gonna stick, and the good, the good part, the crispy part, sticks to the pan. But they were still, they are still pretty spot on, and then we also, well, me, I put cinnamon on one of my bananas, and that was good, and it was fine because it was just ground cinnamon, it wasn't cinnamon sugar, so. For warning, if you're doing this and you haven't made it to day four and tried skim milk yet, be careful. Because you can't cheat. Like, you, you're you like, oh, I'm gonna do day four without, like, no. You have to do the skim milk. That's, that's what the challenge is. The moment you change something, you're not doing the day four means that we're halfway done. And I feel good. good. I can like see a lot in like my body and stuff. So I mean, I look good. My face is getting so defined. Like <laughs> I'm just, <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I don't have any makeup on right now. Like and my skin, skin and it's very, 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 very clean. Um, I'm fixing to go on a run. She's fixing to go to work. Nothing that interesting because this is my. I'm not working out today. Um, we're gonna play the connect tonight. But as far as me going to like a gym or anything, it's not gonna happen. We had different lifestyles before the before the challenge. I worked out, I would say four to five times a week. I don't like to run and that's like my biggest thing. I don't go to gyms because I don't do people very well. And I've been waiting for our pool to be open forever. Yeah, that's also been a big part. Plus she works every day. So it's not like being lazy or anything. It's just like we just have different lifestyles. Well, tomorrow's gonna be uh, veggies and brown rice. Yep, veggies and brown rice for her. And veggies and uh, I got perch fish for me. This challenge is about beat into the ground because tomorrow's day five. We still haven't cheated. We are still doing what we need to do. The yoga poses, green tea, lemon water, blah, blah, blah. So it can be done with can do attitude. Still seeing differences and stuff. I haven't weighed in. I'm going to weigh in. Yeah. I'm going to weigh in tonight. I kind of don't want to because I don't feel like I'm anywhere near 10 pounds lighter, but excuse me. Three more days left in the challenge. 
She has a pop. At least we're almost done. This is the halfway mark um, for us. Tomorrow's the 4th of July. So, it's gonna kind of suck that you can't really go to like a barbecue or. You can go. Stuff, you better not cheat though. <laughs> <laughs> you can go. But make sure that you stick to your diet. Yeah, but we can do stuff like our lemon water. And like we can roast our veggies, you know. We could do it big, like do well with the seasoning and I mean we're just gonna have our own fun. Fourth of July is not about the eating. I mean, you're almost done. Have fun with it. And we're, we're doing it, you're doing it. If you're thinking about doing the challenge, my only thing would be for you to be mentally ready. Um right before you start, we had like a whole revelation, like this is something we're gonna do. We're gonna do it now, we're gonna do it now. We don't want to put it off so it was kind of like we got ourselves pumped up if you get yourself mentally motivated you'll be more successful at it and it'll be a lot more fun your whole day doesn't have to be about food or the challenge it's just a part of your day stay motivated find something uh think about the body that you want or think about the lifestyle you want or if you had kids what would you feed your kids? Something with a ton of sugar in it or something that's more clean? I was also gonna say, this is probably one of the roughest clean eating challenges. There are other challenges that include meat every day or like um, they, they'll focus more on like five different snacks a day and they'll tell you what to eat at those times. Uh, this one's kind of more, you really have to self-discipline yourself. Mm -hmm. If you're watching this video in time, have a safe weekend, um, have a lot of fun pig out for me since I can't like share comment thank you for watching